How's it going viewers? Thank you guys for watching this video. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to do a factory reset on an iPhone 7. And for those that are not quite sure what a factory reset is, is it clears the phone of all data, deletes all pictures, contacts, videos, any kind of data that is on the phone will be wiped clean. It will be put back to its factory or original settings as if you were just gotten a new phone. So there are two big reasons why I use the factory reset option. The first one is if you're getting rid of your phone and you want to delete everything off the phone, you go ahead and do this and it will clear the phone. And the second reason is if you're having a minor malfunction, something is wrong with the phone, it's not working quite right, I back my phone up just to save all my information, all my data, and then I do the factory reset to clear any kind of software bugs or glitches that are currently on the phone. And then I reset with my old information, back it back up to the phone, and I'm able to use it like that. If the phone has a passcode lock or is disabled, you are not able to do a factory reset. You'll have to do a hard reset. So if you'd like to check out the hard reset, I will have a link in the description below. So you guys can go ahead and check that out there. As far as the factory reset is if your phone is unlocked, uh, all we're going to want to do is back up the information. If you are going to be saving your phones, uh, if you're having a glitch, something's not working right, Go ahead, back up all your information before doing this, like I had done previously. Back everything up, and then we will do a hard reset. If you're going to sell your phone, you don't really have to back it up unless you're going to be getting another uh, iPhone device that you can just transfer all your information there. So what we're going to go ahead and do is start off by going into settings. And from settings, go to general. Once you are here in general, go ahead and scroll down till you get to the bottom. Once you're at the bottom, go ahead and select reset. Once we are here... There's reset all settings, re erase all content and settings, reset network settings, reset keyboard dictionary, reset home screen layout, and reset the location and privacy. The one we want is erase all content and settings. We can go ahead and select that. And it says this will delete all media and data and reset all settings. So we're just going to go ahead, hit erase iPhone. Are you sure you want to continue? All media, data, and settings will be erased. This cannot be undone. So if you hit the erase and continue, it will delete and remove everything. So if you haven't gotten it backed up, you will lose uh, all the stuff that's not backed up. So go ahead, erase iPhone, and it's starting to erase. So this factory reset will not unlock any carrier. So if your phone was with AT&T previously or with Verizon, it will stay that way. This is not a way to change your carrier. This will not unlock the phone. All it does is clears it, puts it back to factory settings. And here it's just pretty much deleting all information off the phone. And it's going to boot it, start booting it back up with all of the new information on there. So now it's booting up all the information with a new clean iPhone. Back to the factory original settings. It's going to start you off back on the hello screen. So there we are, we are back on the hello screen. It's gonna want us to start it up and I'm just gonna go ahead and set this up as a new iPhone as if I were to sell it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and select English back to the United States. And I'm gonna go ahead and hook up to the internet that I have. So now that I have my password typed in, I'm gonna go ahead and hit join. It's gonna link up to my internet and I should be able to activate my phone. It may take a few minutes to activate your phone. And if you're doing this and you don't have a SIM card in, it will not uh, start up the phone. You won't be able to get it to the home screen without a SIM card, so you'll need to put one in. And then here we are at the location services, disable location services. And at this point, if you're going to sell it, I just set everything up as zero. So set up touch ID later, continue, just that way it has none of your information. Passcode options, do not add passcode. Are you sure you don't want a passcode? Yes. And I hit continue. Apps and data. And at this point, I'm going to be setting up as a new iPhone. That way I could sell it and none of my information is on there. If you are going to be backing it up, you can back, uh, restore it from iTunes, restore it from iCloud. I'm just going to go ahead and do set up as a new, uh, new iPhone. And at this point, you don't want your information in if you're going to sell it. So I'm just going to go ahead and set it up later in settings. And don't use for the pop-up that appears there. Terms and conditions, I'm going to go ahead and hit agree. Use Siri, don't use Siri. Uh, don't send any diagnostic issues. Customize later in settings for the home button. 
zoom you have to choose one of the views so i'm just going to go ahead do the zoomed and continue welcome to iphone get started and here just will pretty much back uh, come on and as you guys can see here i got a phone that just pretty much factory settings nothing on there none of my information is in here uh it is now i can give it away i can sell it it's cleared no issues so if somebody were to buy it um, when I go to buy used phones, I like to see them here at this screen. That way I could check the IMEI and I know that there are no um, iCloud locks or activation locks, anything that will be associated with it later. So that is how you do a factory reset on an iPhone 7. Hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you know somebody that might be struggling with this issue, you can go ahead and share this with them. Let them know there is a solution for their problem. Uh, if you guys would like to see more tutorials like this, you guys can go ahead and subscribe to my page. I also have an iPhone 7 playlist with different tutorials that I have done. You guys can check that out as well. And once again, if you guys need the hard reset version to reset your phone with a passcode or disabled, you can check that out in the description below as well. So that's all I got for you guys on this one. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day.